Welcome. In front of me is a Realme C35 and today I'll show you how you can enable and also set up your do not disturb mode. So to get started, pull down your notifications, expand it and look for the toggle. For me it's located right over here, third toggle from the top. Uh, now this is the default location of the toggle so I assume you will probably find yours in the same exact location. Now once you locate it, can hold it the first time around this will quickly take you to the settings where you can customize how it actually functions so we have uh, exceptions for people uh, meaning who can call you or message you uh, ops and alarms along with other interruptions so those are like the uh, ways you can sec select exceptions for just the do not disturb mode and additionally below that we have things like schedule so you can basically set it up so your do not disturb mode turns on and off automatically then we have duration uh, for quick settings this refers to the toggle so what happens when you tap on a toggle uh, by default it is set to until turn off but you can also set it to be a timer or give you the option every time you tap on it and then we have also options for just notifications now once you went to the settings and selected ones that uh, you want you can close this and never have to go back here again assuming you don't want to change any settings and whenever you want to use your do not disturb mode uh, manually all you would do is just press on the toggle to turn it on and it's right now enabled and if you're using the scheduled mode as you can see right here uh, all you would need to do is make sure that the schedule mode is checked on like oh. there we go like this so whatever the settings of the schedule are, uh, whenever the time approaches for it, it will turn on. And then once the time has passed, it will turn off. So just make sure this is turned on and only this. Now, when it comes down to the manual use, uh, once you're done with your do not disturb mode, you can tap on a toggle once again to turn it off. So anyway, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.